Recognized, Emily of Arden, D-1-2. Hello team, and welcome to Intel Update 17. This episode is going to be just a nice little end-of-year holiday wrap-up with a couple important announcements about our show. So, let's dive in. 2020 has been a tough year for a lot of reasons, and I'm sure many of you have been wondering what's been happening with Whelmed since we haven't released that many episodes since the end of season three. Well, since the finale of last season, we've been planning a lot of stuff to hold us over until season four premieres, but then 2020 happened. A pandemic, my final year of college, and just some general unforeseen happenings in the lives of all of our team members led to a lot of things just not happening this year. We want to thank all of you listening at home for being so patient with us and sticking around while we adapt and do our best to continue making a quality podcast despite the general state of the world. With all of that said, here is an update on what you can expect. New episodes of Whelmed will start dropping in January on a bi-weekly basis. That means one episode every two weeks, rather than our previous one episode every week. This is going to be a little more sustainable for us as we wait to have a whole season of episodes to review whenever those will be coming out eventually. We'll be starting the year off with three great discussion episodes, one between me and the amazing Zara Fuzzle, the voice of Halo, which we recorded this past summer, one between me, Greg Weissman, and Brandon Vietti that was recorded just back in October, and one between me and Jeff Stormer, the host of Party of One podcast and the creator behind a bunch of different stuff on the internet from just last month. These were all such fantastic conversations, and we can't wait for all of you to hear them. In 2021, we are also planning to finally implement a big overhaul of our Patreon page. Some of our previous awards just weren't sustainable for us, and we want to make sure that we're offering our patrons fun incentives that we can actually make work and deliver on. So next year, we'll be continuing some old rewards, but adding some awesome new ones, including access to a private Discord server where our patrons can chat with each other and our podcast team about the show, Young Justice, comics, and more. We'll be finalizing and announcing more new rewards in the coming months as well, so keep an eye out for those. We also have some other great content in the works right now. We're trying to get together even more discussion sessions, some Elseworlds reviews, and more Young Justice analysis, including a much-anticipated Super Sweethearts episode about Red Arrow and Cheshire, whenever I can finally sit down and finish talking about those two. We also have some ideas for some other special episodes that might be happening next year, including Secret Origins Into the Light and a deep dive into the plot of the Young Justice video game. So if you guys are interested in either of those, just keep an ear out for updates on that. Until then, if you are missing our voices here at Whelmed, here's some other things you can go check out to hear what we've been up to. Here at Whelmed, we talk a lot about teenage superheroes, but if you'd like to hear me play a teen superhero instead of just discussing them, then head over to Protean City Comics. This actual play tabletop RPG podcast uses the role-playing game Masks to tell the stories of a bunch of different teenage superheroes in the world of Protean City. Over there, I play Highwire, a circus-themed former criminal turned superhero with a knack for backflips and knife throwing. You can catch all three of the arcs I appeared in, including the most recent steampunk what-if style miniseries called Flickering Streets, at the link in the show notes. And if you listen to your podcast on Spotify, the Protean City Comics crew has even put together a fantastic playlist of all of Highwire's adventures so far, for your listening convenience. 
If you want even more of me playing superheroes in tabletop RPGs and want to prepare for Jeff Stormer's upcoming return to Whelmed, then check out my two guest appearances on Party of One. In the first, Jeff and I played through a superhero rom-com between Hawkeye and Black Widow using the indie RPG Slashing the Veil, and in the second, we used the game Follow to explore an unlikely team-up between Catwoman and The Question. You can find links to both of those down in the show notes or wherever you listen to podcasts. If you'd like to support my voice acting career, you can check out Arson, a fantasy mystery audio drama. There I play Nyx, a member of the Royal Fairy Guard tasked with protecting our protagonist. You can find Arson wherever you listen to podcasts or again at the link in the show notes. And if you want to support my voice acting career even more... Then next year, in 2021, you can check out Dark Valley, an upcoming sci-fi fantasy anthology podcast that tells stories of emotional and psychological journeys in fantastical worlds. It's inspired by The Twilight Zone and Black Mirror and some other really cool anthology things. And I can't tell you much about my own character yet, but I can tell you that I play a role in episode three, which will be out on January 21st. And you can check out the first two episodes of the series when they premiere on January 7th. When it comes to what my co-host Rich Howard has been up to, it's been a lot. (laughs) Way back in February, Rich and the rest of the design team of Descent into Midnight funded their Kickstarter in the first day. If you want to check out the game, you can go to DescentIntoMidnight.com, link in the show notes, which has the Kickstarter video, the link to the backer kit where people can still pre-order the game, and you can download the quick start and play the most recent playtest version right there. The pandemic has understandably delayed production, but at the moment, the final game should be out by June of next year, if not earlier. So if you want to play a cool game about aquatic worlds and emotional storytelling and seven other very rich Howard things, check out Descent into Midnight. If you're missing Rich talking about Young Justice and haven't checked out his guest spot on the Gameable podcast, he and former discussion guest Chris Newton spent over four hours across three episodes talking about Young Justice and converting the story arcs, themes, and tropes into role-playing games. They talked mechanics, storytelling, and a bunch of other really cool stuff, and you can find the link to that, again, down in the show notes. And while you're over at Party of One, listening to me play Catwoman and Black Widow and tell very specific superhero stories, you can also check out Rich, who joined Jeff in a GM-less session of Masks, playing one of his favorite characters, the haunting and haunted Wisp. Think Robin crossed with Bod from Neil Gaiman's The Graveyard Book. It's an adventure, and you should definitely check it out at the link in the show notes. When it comes to our fantastic producer, Neil, he has also been up to things. As always, you can check out new episodes of the DMnastics and Dungeon Masters Block podcasts coming out weekly wherever you listen to podcasts. If you want to hear our incredible producer, Neil, break down gaming mechanics and tabletop RPGs and a bunch of other stuff. Neil is also dangerously close to shipping out physical copies of the D&D 5th edition supplement he co-wrote and funded via Kickstarter, known as The Ultimate Guide to Hair, A Supplement to Die For. It should be available soon on DriveThruRPG as well, if you'd prefer to get a PDF. And so, with all of that out of the way, I think we can officially Zeta out of the Watchtower for this year. Thank you for spending some time with us. If you'd like to join us in discussing this incredible series, you can find us on Twitter at the YJ Files, on Facebook at Crashing the Mode, on Tumblr at the YJFiles.tumblr.com, on our website CrashingTheMode.com, and if that still isn't enough for you, you can email us at whelmedpodcast at gmail.com. You can also find us on YouTube, Stitcher, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. 
If you'd like to support our show, please consider sharing with a friend and joining our chats on social media. You can also support the show by giving us a five-star review and or rating on Apple Podcasts or your podcatcher of choice. The ratings, comments, and subscriptions help others find the show. And if you do leave us a rating, please let us know at our email address or on social media, especially if you live outside the U.S., since we have to look a little harder to find those, and we'd love to be able to thank you. If you're able to support us monetarily, please consider becoming a patron at patreon.com slash crashing the mode. Even $1 a month can help us do in-person interviews when those again become a thing, actual play podcasts, more discussion sessions, and even more cool stuff. So as we wrap up 2020, happy holidays, whatever you celebrate. Have a nice winter if you celebrate nothing. And remember, Stay warmed, everyone. Happy New Year, Justice League. Now I should have done this a long time ago. No kidding. <laughs> Liking this team more every day. Human customs still elude me. You've been listening to Whelmed, the Young Justice Files podcast. Our hosts are Rich Howard and Emily Booza. Our editor and producer is Neil Powell. Our theme was composed by Emily Mio. Our logo was created by Kevin Bates. Whelmed is a fan-made podcast and is not officially affiliated with DC Comics, DC Entertainment, Warner Brothers Animation, and any other owners of Young Justice or its related source material. As such, these companies have sole ownership of all symbols, images, names, logos, and proprietary material related to Young Justice. Original content of this podcast is ours under Creative Commons. Thanks for listening, and stay whelmed.